Hi, Robert Esther here at livingpianos.com. And today we're gonna to cover the subject about myths about piano appraisals. Well, what are piano appraisals anyway? Well, piano appraisals are not what you might think. If you're thinking, oh, I wanna know what I could sell my piano for, that's not the purpose of a piano appraisal. In fact, a piano appraisal is a specific legal document meant to satisfy requirements such as insurance uh, protection or estate settlement. And the appraiser is actually legally liable in cases of tax fraud. So they have to really research it very carefully. Well, how come you can't just get your piano appraised so you know what you can sell it for? Well, there's a lot of reasons. First of all, pianos aren't like other things. Cars, houses, there are so many countless comparable sales to look at that you can kind of nail down a margin of what a house might sell for, or even a car, there's even bluebook.com, you can find out about what a car is gonna sell for. There's so many different piano brands from years past, the condition ranges tremendously. On top of that, there's the complication of the type of sale. Well, for example, if you go into a store, you're gonna get one price, but if you go on Craigslist, private party prices are quite different. Trade-in values, yet another. Consignment, you might get a different value, so you get the idea that there isn't one value for a piano. One way you could really get your head around this is go on eBay, search for a specific piano. If you have a piano, take a look and you'll find other people who have similar pianos for sale. You go, oh, that's what my piano is worth. Well, not so fast. Go to the left column and check sold listings and you're gonna get a completely different set of listings with drastically different prices of what the pianos actually have historically sold for in the past month or two. So that's the long and short of it. Piano appraisals are an important legal document. And indeed, if you, you know, lost your piano in a fire and you had to replace it just like that, and you just didn't want to hunt all around, you want to just go downtown to the nearest piano store and find one that's like it, sure, you might pay that appraised value. And that's the whole purpose. You shouldn't be put out if an insurance claim. A state settlement, you want some kind of comparable value that people can know what they're dividing up. So it satisfies things in that way, but it really doesn't have much to do with what you could sell your piano for, what wholesale or retail. All right, thanks so much. I hope this has been interesting for you again. Robert Estrin here at livingpianos.com, your online piano store.